Welcome back, guys, to episode 8 of Stranded Junk Trader. Um, in this, like I said in the last episode, we're actually going to jump right into um, getting some Proctite, uh, maybe some Blood Diamonds and stuff like that, because we need um, advanced, I think they're called, no, they're called Quantum Processors. Uh, they require Proctite bars, and uh, we're going to need them if we're going to start getting some more advanced stuff. So we're actually going to jump right into the Proctite world because we actually have uh, that Hoplite helmet that I built the last episode. It uh, blocks Proto Poison and Insanity. I'm going to mine as much as I can, so i uh, see you when I get there. And we're here. Wow, it's actually really windy here. Jeez, okay. Um, it said there was um, like slime storms, and I think there's a chance for acid rain. I've never seen this weather before, though. It's creepy. Let's pick up this. Right. Ooh, anti-gravity rain. What? Ooh, I can actually pick this up then, right? This should be, uh... Yeah, grab liquid. Awesome. Okay, let's uh, just dig straight down. We're after the proctite. I think we might be able to extract proctite from this. Proto-gravel and proto-soil. Not sure yet. And it's been a while. I think proctite is simply just uh, yellow splotches. So we should find it pretty easily. Let's see, is this proctite... Yes, it is. Okay. Now we know what it looks like. Oh, and some triangulum ore. Let's see. Triang... Trianglium. Okay. Trianglium ore. That'll be useful later on. Oh, what's that? Defense minus 10. Wait, for why? From... From this? Dense proto shale. Gives you defense minus 10%. Huh. Uh, I'm not really sure how much uh, we're really going to try to get uh, in terms of like thorium or other resources, like this triangular, uh, triangle, whatever, triangle ore. <laughs> I'll just I'll just call it triangle ore from now on. Uh, yeah. It just makes me tongue tied a little bit. Uh, yeah, it's a pretty good level. Oh, crap. So yeah, I'm not sure how much of the thorium we're going to pick up, but I'm going to do this until I get oh wow we're already 120 holy crap okay yeah 200 for sure once I get 200 I'll meet you guys back at the base and we're here guys and holy crap this is dangerous oh my god welcome to the creep the creepiest fucking planet in this whole fucking mod just flesh everywhere and highly highly dangerous enemies Oh, and good anti grav rain too. Oh boy. So this whole planet is basically living. It's basically just flesh. Um, and we're looking for blood diamonds and quietus ore. Oh, I'm not prepared for this. Man, it's been a while. I'm not exactly. Oh man, creepy ass music. Actually, I thought I turned music off. I guess it, I guess it overrides it. Let me check for a sec. Yeah, I have music turned off, so I guess that's just the creepy ass background music that I can't I can't remove. Oh, and it's raining blood too. That's good. Oh God. What's this? Is this blood diamond? Yes. 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 Yeah, really potent. Oh, blood. Okay. Learn to craft the blood. Oh, God. Oh, there's heartbeats when you go lower. There you go. Quite a sore. Oh, that's not creepy at all. It's funny. It, it actually reminds me of the uh, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Uh, heartbeat sound. It's actually like a f funny story. As a kid, I'd always get freaked out whenever my parents would watch that. I'd actually like get nightmares because of the heartbeat. So uh, yeah, it's giving me uh, PTSD here, bringing back some uh, terrible childhood memories of being surrounded by fucking flesh. Oh god, what are those? Whatever they are, they're gonna die. Oh my god, these are tough guys. Yeah, we need. We definitely need to upgrade, because I think this is just a dangerous thing. Crap. I'm just about to stop recording. This stuff right here, we need tons of this stuff. Blood crystal. Yep, now we can make quietus ore. Um, I think in the biolab. 
I think we just put this in the bio lab and it takes 20 or no it takes 50 50 of this and I can get some quietus ore and then I, I think uh, yeah I extract it and then I can get uh, blood diamonds so we're just gonna pick up as much as this as we can and we're back let's see what uh, we got from that hole okay we can use our quietus or to build quietus bars but we're actually not going to do that first we're actually going to make all our proctite i'm not sure if you use proctite normally for anything well we got we got plenty so let's just make it and advanced alloy proto gun proto pistol i wish you could actually hover over this and see what else um we got a bunch of stuff uh, wow we got lots that's good let's build these which will unlock some stuff Advanced Dash, Raider Armor, <laughs> Neptunium Rods, let's build all these actually, as well as one Thorium Rod, just as I suspected. Uh, we uh, At the Biochem Lab, you can take Blood Crystals, and for every 50, you get one Quietus Ore, and you can either use that Ore um, to make Quietus Bars, or... You can actually extract it using your extractor. Let's take a whole stack and put it in here. And when you extract it, you get blood diamond. So uh, either way, if you have a lot of this stuff, you're all set. Build. You can build one right off the bat. Quantum processor. Now, I, now I've built, I can build the uh, AI chip, but I need a Morphite bar. Morphite right here. And then once I build this, I'm pretty sure it unlocks the Morphite bar. Hmm. Well, this episode wasn't too eventful, but, uh, well, at least I got to show you the two uh, worlds that I was talking about in the last episode, and you just need to build the Hoplite Helmet so you can resist the uh, debuffs that both both of those um, worlds get. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for the next episode where hopefully uh, we'll build some more stuff. So yeah, thanks for watching.